Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. It's just, it's all going to be okay. This is Saturday, December 5th still, and it's 4.15 p.m. I was trying to knock out some more emails. And, um, this was a confirmation from, excuse me, my pharmacy. And below that, on that same page, were some articles. Now listen to this one. Combo treatment for COVID-19 gets green light. But what caught my eye was the picture, which I am going to use for my, what do you call that thing, thumbnail. And see what you don't notice. First thing, well, I'll just tell you. It's a DNA molecule. Well, it's a DNA twisted chain. You know how they look twisted, like you take a ladder and twist it. So in front of this, what looks to be a research scientist or doctor maybe, there's a vial, there's a pill, there's some, um, what are these six-sided figures, hexagons? There's a mask, there's a syringe with a needle on it. He's reading a paper, like a report maybe. But, but sticking out about, I mean, in whites and light blues is this DNA thing. So it's like right in your face. We are going to change your DNA. This is on Rx Wiki. So Wikipedia has a section for drugs. And I don't really care what the drug is, but I'll tell you about it for a little bit. Rx Wiki News says, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration, or FDA, has approved baricitinib, baricitinib, and you can click on that if you want, in combination with remdesivir, now that one I'd heard of, they were using, to treat COVID-19. This combination of two drugs was granted an emergency use authorization, or EUA, to treat adults and children two years old and older who have COVID-19, are in the hospital, and need oxygen therapy or mechanical ventilation. In a clinical trial... This combination was shown to reduce the time to recovery within 29 days after starting treatment compared to those who were not given these drugs. It is important to note that an EUA or emergency use authorization is different from an FDA approval. For the EUA issuance, the FDA determined it was reasonable to believe the combination of these two drugs may be effective in treating COVID-19 and the known and potential benefits outweighed the known and potential risks. And you can find the link in the description box if you want to read more. Now, do y'all remember how I showed you how to find the green light? I mean, green light, I saw green light. How to find the description box if you're using a cell phone. 
because many people were saying they didn't know, they couldn't see the description box. Okay. What is this? I, I get so many ding, dings like that, and I don't know what in the world they're trying to tell me. Okay, let's see. I think I have to hit Google Chrome. And then... Is y'all's phone this slow to pull up something? It just seems to take forever. Oh, well, let me try to explain. Once you get your YouTube video up here, and underneath, you're going to see the title, okay? Oh, is that a YouTube video? No, I think it was an article. Well, anyway, look underneath for the title, and over at the far right, there will be an upside-down triangle for you to, it's pointing down so tap on that and it'll open up the description box okay that's how to get to the links and information like the extra stuff that maybe scriptures or that other video I forgot to put all the scriptures but if you go to the link it'll take you to the original source where all the scriptures are I apologize for that. I actually thought about that last night. Anyway, funny times for when you remember. So I'm going to end this here. I just had to share that with you. It's just in your face. There's no denying it. They want to change your DNA. Please try to tell as many people as you can. Okay, that's all for now. I'll talk to you later.